Hey guys, my name's Tanya. I'm Tim. And welcome to Timu Tuesday. And sadly, we don't have any more Halloween stuff to show you. So we're back at showing you regular items again. Items that we want to buy, that we want to try. Clothes. I have some clothes this time. I don't think you have a lot of clothes this time, do you? I don't do you? have any clothes this time. You don't? No. You don't have any? I thought, what about the shirt I got you? Where is that shirt? What'd you do with it? Yeah, well, it's right here. <laughs> I got him a shirt and he lost it already. He hasn't even worn it. No, what do I have to do with that shirt? What'd you do to it? Uh, that might be the next one. <laughs> and it was a super cool shirt too, y'all. So, okay, well, guess what? <laughs> Subscribe so that you can come watch it next week and see what we got. Uh, I'm going to start first. We already did a video on this uh, to see if it worked or not so that I could let you know. It's this mini vacuum cleaner. Y'all have probably come across this. It's probably come across your feed. It's been across my feed. Like, I couldn't tell you how many times. But normally, it was... Look, I even wrote the regular price on here. $10.98 for this little thing. And I was like, there's no way I'm paying that. Well, they sent me uh, an, one of those 90% off things or whatever. Of course, it's not 90% off. But I got it for $5.49. And I'm like, well, I'll try it and see if it works. Technically, it works. So here it is. It's just this little bitty handheld vacuum cleaner. It still has the dirt in there from the Jeep. So we took this out and vacuumed, <laughs> vacuumed the carpet in the Jeep and technically it worked. It picked everything up. It picked everything up. It just gonna take a really long time to do it. <laughs> so I don't know. You have to keep it charged with USB. So I'm not real sure if this is worth getting or not. Even at the 548, technically no. it works. I mean, you could use it for at home, like he was saying, what computers and yeah, stuff like computers. that. But then I was thinking after that, I'm like, well, what's your canned air for? Well, a lot of people don't have can here, though. Oh. Yeah. Well, he does. So, uh, yeah, I was thinking, well, it's really not going to serve no. us any purpose, mm -hmm. honestly. So. Made a good little video, though, with it. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to insert the clip so that you can actually see it working. I would probably rate this like a 5 out of 10 because yeah. it does work and it does maybe a 6 because it does work. And it even picked up. You can see the like maybe the little rock pebbles in there. But, um... If you had a big mess, that would take you forever to clean it up. Forever. Yeah. Forever. So, small spills, I say, yeah. Yeah. Other than that, I'm going to say no. Here's the clip. Yep. <laughs> It technically works. Yeah, it's a small thing. I mean, if you had to do the whole vehicle, it probably takes you forever. <laughs> yeah, overall. I mean, I mean up, technically it works. I mean, if you had to pick up like, some kids' shoes or something like that real quick, it's, you know, not too close up, but it's already done already, so, right? Well, I don't think it's close to yeah. It's still. I mean, I mean, technically it works. Yeah, no. it does work. Yeah. So if you get it super cheap, then why not? But this will actually be good for um, keyboards. And oh, yeah, I didn't computer, think about that. Little yeah. small computer stuff. Yeah, instead but of a car. You see, it actually sucks a lot, yeah. a lot of stuff up. Technically, it works. Yep. That, it's funny. You, see, you paid how much for that one? 548 Let's see, and I got this one was actually one of the discount things, too. It was actually 8 59 and I got it for 549 That's funny. Yeah. But it's actually a... Um, I've seen this popped up on my feed quite a bit too. Um, it's supposed to be a one button adjustable um, cell phone holder for your vehicle. It's supposed to have a nice tight base where you, when you plug it down, it's supposed to hold in place. I'm hoping- You got it for the Jeep though, I yeah. I got it for the Jeep, what I got it for, because we can never get one to stay in the Jeep mm -mm. good enough, so. No, the last but couple yeah. ones we've gotten don't, it's just because the way the dash the dashes are in Jeeps, they're like, well, at least ours. We have a 2008. So the way that the dash is, it doesn't have a whole lot of flat mm. space. <laughs> so hopefully this will work, but we'll see. We'll I mean, see. We'll try it out. We'll put in a clip, let you know if we love it or hate it. But yeah. it's supposed to, like I said, it's supposed to tighten down. It things. looks super beastie yeah. though, like currently, just sitting here. Yeah. It, it really does look, 
and it has like all the different movements and right. functions. And it's so. all single button to move everything. So, so maybe, we'll I see. mean, we'll see. Try it. Give it a shot. Yeah. We tried it and it doesn't stick at all. All right. I ordered a Jersey. So <laughs> of course y'all know if you shop Timu that you can't, uh, like necessarily look for your team. <laughs> you just gotta like hope it pops up in your feed, honestly. Y'all know I'm a Bears fan. Uh, even with our crappy record, I don't care. Uh, I'll always be a Bears fan. I paid $15.65 for this and I had, I had it in my car, I lost it. I had it in my car, I lost it. And as soon as it came available again, I just went ahead and purchased it. Cause here where we are, you only have to ha have $10 to get your free shipping and you can check out. So that's what we do here. So here it is. It's actually, I haven't opened this yet. So y'all are seeing this with me. So far, the quality is really nice. As far as the jersey is concerned, the lettering is stitched and it has the number one and it has Justin Fields name on the back. It's so, spelled correctly too. And it's spelled it's spelled correctly. <laughs> now, nowhere else does it say Chicago Bears on it or NFL or any name brand, nothing like that. All it does is say this on the back and it has the number 1 on the front. But everybody knows who Justin Fields is, so I feel like that's enough said as far as I'm concerned. So, I'm going to try this on for you and I'm going to insert a clip so that you can see what it looks like on. I did grab a large because this is like in the men's section, not in the women's section. So hopefully it fits me. Hopefully it's like not too tight around my guts or anything, but we'll see. I think it'll be, hopefully it'll be okay. Yeah. We'll see. Okay, and here's the jersey. As you can tell, it's super long too. There it is. And this one is a large, don't forget. So I got a men's. This is in the men's section, so it's a men's large. So it does fit, you know, around here. It doesn't have like, there's no stretch to it, but just know that it's gonna be long no matter what, if you buy these jerseys off of there. So, still pretty cool. Paid $1.99 for this, and it's actually just a uh, cell phone case. This is actually is one that you sent me. Jeez, that actually, thing's like beastie. It came in its own box. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually one that you sent me. Actually. I don't think I've actually. <gasps> Does that, that uh, oh, I can't, look, I can't wait to see this. I sent this to him because I'm like, there's no way this is right. There's no way what they're saying on there, it works the way they're saying it works. Yeah, and I got to mess with it and see how that is. So, um, it, yeah. We'll just have to show you a video and we'll show the clip of everything it says it's supposed to be able to do. Yeah, because I have a feeling just from looking at it now, it, it, it doesn't. No, exactly. It's a liar. Because <laughs> no. according to the, the thing I saw, it acted like, I don't know. Ooh, I don't know yeah, though. It's, it's possible. Ooh, that's glass or something you know, on this there. this actually connects into the bottom down there. So it actually Man, did. if this thing works, this is going to be super cool. I, I hope when you see this clip that it's super cool because yeah. it just really looked <laughs> neat on there. And you, I know you paid up for it because these were more expensive. They were, but then I had the, the discount. Thing oh, you did in. get yeah. one? Oh, you lucky So and that was one that popped up in my... How like, much? So what'd you pay? $1.99 for that one. Are you serious? Yes. See, I think it was seven forty nine dollars originally. Yeah, it was a lot. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited. I can't wait. <laughs> okay. That's exciting. I didn't know you went ahead and got it already. Yeah. And as you see, it is um, it an iPhone Lightning connection to it, so. Oh, uh, we'll see, because it's supposed to be like, if I'm not mistaken, I think it's supposed to be like either music activated or voice activated, something like yeah. that, if I remember. It's been a minute since I sent it to him. All right, here's his phone, his case. So he just sent it a text message. And the whole, you saw the whole back of it light up. It didn't light up that time. I think it's because it was still um, lit up on the other side over there. I guess it's an Is it partially lit up somewhere? Oh, there it goes again. Yeah. How cool is that? This is feels like it's it looks like glass, glass or something. Yeah. Oh, so when you tap it. Yeah, it reacts to you and stuff. This thing is cool. I like it. That's pretty sweet. 
yeah, it, it does what it said it was going to do. I didn't think it would. I really didn't, but it does. This is a pretty sweet case. They had other ones, too. Yes. So, yeah. Just let me know if you want the link. And I like the grip on the side. It's, it's not slick or anything. It's yeah. It's actually got a good grip on the side. Yeah. This thing's cool. Okay. I got this top. This is more expensive than what I got it for. I got it for $5.44. I just put it in my cart, let it sit there, and then they sent me an offer on it. So it lights up on the back. Oh, it does light up right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it does different things. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure when the phone rings and all that stuff too and everything. So it is going to do something. <laughs> Can't wait. Okay. Can't wait. I'm excited. All right. So this, look, I wanted to unwrap this one because we're about to go out of town again, y'all. Sorry. Uh, we're going to another concert uh, up in Birmingham. But I'm hoping to be able to wear this shirt because he said it's supposed to be chilly up there. Mm -hmm. So this is a long sleeve shirt. And it's kind of like that, um, got that like that gauze material. I ordered a 2X. I'm hoping it's baggy. It's like a color block type shirt. It has really pretty uh, colors on it. So I was hoping to wear like one of my uh, t-shirts like underneath it and just wear this hanging, you know, over the top of it. So hopefully that works out the way that I want it to. But y'all see a video. I'll insert a video of what it looks like on. But like I said, I ordered the 2X. I always order up just to make sure that it'll fit. And I wanted this to be baggy because I just really wanted it to be more like a throw over than wearing it as a full on shirt. So, okay, this one's pretty dang big too. So I've rolled the sleeves a couple of times. It could probably use one more maybe. But I buttoned it up, which is not the way that I really want to wear it. So the shirt that I have on underneath obviously does not go with it at all. But I just wanted to see, I wanted y'all to see how big it was with it buttoned up. It's supposed to be like seriously oversized and it is. So yeah, definitely oversized. <laughs> so I actually bought this for my dad. Um, it's $1.89. It's actually just a sticker that says United Air Force Veteran um, for the phone his boat or his truck. Because he is. Yep. <laughs> so it's so simple. I got a fail. And it's not necessarily a fail on Timu. It's a fail on Tanya. Because Tanya didn't quite look at the picture like she should have. So technically I got what I ordered. But I don't know that I'm going to wear it. It's a sweatshirt. It's a Chicago Bears sweatshirt. I paid, <laughs> I got it on a deal. I paid $6.34 for this sweatshirt. I'm gonna open it up and then I'm gonna let y'all look at it real quick <laughs> and see if you can guess what's wrong with it. <laughs> and then tell me how I can fix it. I think I might be able to fix it with a Sharpie. Yeah. Um, I think you can probably cut the little section. I'm scared to do that, <laughs> that I'll cut the fabric, but Look, y'all tell me what the problem is here. So this, this is a hoodie, by the way. All right, here it is. Can Do you see anything wrong with that at all? Anything? So when it came in and I saw it, I said, no. What's wrong with that G? That's not a G. I don't even know what that is. So I feel like I could just like make it into a G right here. Like if I could just like take a Sharpie and, and put a black, cause this is black and draw like a black box over this blue or like maybe a little marker, like one of those little permanent markers. You, do you think that'll work? I think it'll work. <coughs> it's got a weird smell to it. It's making me cough. <laughs> I gotta wash it. He thinks I should just use like one of those little exacto knives, but I'm afraid I will cut the underneath. Knowing me, I probably would. It wouldn't work out the way I wanted it to. So I'm going to try that. When I went back and looked at the picture, it looks exactly like this. <laughs> so this is totally my fault. So I'm going to try to fix it. It's actually really soft. Mm -hmm. It does have a, it does have like a, I don't know what kind of smell. So it's making me cough a little bit. I do need to wash it, but I don't know. Y'all have any other ideas? That's our idea. His idea is to try to cut it. 
<laughs> Mine is to use like some sort of marker thing. <laughs> you guys tell me what you think. You guys are way more crafty than we are. We'll probably jack it up. <laughs> probably. <laughs> All right, here's my Chicago bear. <laughs> Sure, I did get the 2X. It is pretty dang big, as you can see. So, definitely way, way oversized. So, if you're going to get one of these, you know, Chicago's, then you might want to rethink the size a little bit. Chicago. All right, I actually got this because um, I know how you like to decorate. And you Christmas is right around the corner. That's right. It's so coming. So this will probably be the only Christmas stuff I ever buy, really. Aw. <laughs> but it's just, I don't, there's not too many things that I actually, okay. watch. you see it all one time. I but know. I bet you want to probably find he'll, some He'll else. buy some more stuff. Don't let yeah. him fool you. So this one was uh, $3.99. Uh -huh. It's just a, a little, um, Oh, little the Grinch. Yeah. Is that, that's the Grinch. Yeah. yeah. So cute. Grinch. A little wooden sign. Hang inside or outside. That's cute. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. Ho, ho, ho. Yep. That's adorable. Come with the little yep. strings. Come with the little strings. Like our bear signs did. Yep. My, my bear sign and your was, bangle sign. It might be the same company. I, I was going to say, I think it was the same company. You think? Because they actually had some of the, um, um, yeah, the these are, of signs like what we you know, ordered. Today. Yeah, these so. are real nice because they just, they're super easy. Like you don't, you don't have to do anything. You just poke those little things through there and then it hangs. Yep. Just like that. I mean, these are, too, so. yeah, these are like really good quality. I don't know how long they'll last if you, if you had them in the weather or anything, you know, cause it is like that MDF type board. It's not going to get, if you got wet or something, it wouldn't be right. good. But if you, if you do, and I know a lot of people do, if y'all do a uh, Grinch Christmas tree, this would be good to put on that tree as decoration. Mm -hmm. Cause it's not overly big. So yeah, are we decorating the silver tree? What are we going to decorate it as this year? Because I'm putting them both up. Yeah. Because I got the silver tree at the end of the year. Yeah, so we can probably do so that. So when I take all that Halloween tree. stuff off of it, mm -hmm. you want to just do a full-on yeah. Grinch tree? Okay, do that. let's do yeah. that. Look, I love I love me some Grinch. <laughs> You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. We have to watch it every year. You really? Okay, I got this for the dogs. Actually, I really got it for Poppy because uh, he's the one that likes to chew on this stuff. It's just like one of those uh, nylar, nylar bones or whatever they're called. I can't say it right. Paid a dollar forty-eight for it, and I got two price adjustments on it: one for twenty-two cents and one for twenty-one cents. So I paid a dollar for it. Technically, I think that was your phone. It was my work phone. Yeah. Oh, we're not answering no. that. So it's just like a little baby deer antler thing. Poppy. We'll let him come get it. He can have it. He's probably scared right now. He's probably. Poppy! I think he's in. Uh, oh, is he upstairs? Up so, this was the second item I got you for Christmas. Ooh. Two items. Yeah, I know. It's, Decorate? I know. Yeah. Oh, so, there it is. Stink, stank, stunk. Yep. Nice. It's a flag for outside. Yeah, I like that one. And it's that nice material where. That burlap yeah. stuff. God, you, you just can't beat these flags. I'm serious. You all yeah. know I'm, I'm, I am, I love me some flags. Yeah, and this was uh, 5 30 I paid for this one. Did you? Yeah. I like that one. <laughs> Guess what? So you all know I'm building, I, I built my uh, Pandora fake bracelet thing. I have so many charms now, I had to order another bracelet. Because I can't get them all on there. I know it's sad. So I paid 90 cents for this one. This is just another little snake bracelet. And I coated it. My last one that I got that had the little puppy paw on it. I coated it with a clear fingernail polish, y'all. What what I do that? Like three months ago? Mm -hmm. It's worked perfectly. So every little charm that I've gotten in that doesn't say 925 on it, I've done the same thing with those charms. And I have had zero discoloration. So, yeah, it worked. Y'all are the bomb. And like I said, you guys know more than I do. <laughs> All right, so oh. I actually bought two different rings here just to see how they were. One was $239 and one was $285. I'm tired today. The $285 one, as you can tell, that you hold that one there. Oh, I like great. that. Yeah. And That's then cool. this one, um, this one's kind of like these are soft on the inside, too. Yeah, this one's got the Roman numerals that almost looks it. like your wedding ring, almost. Yeah, but it's actually like a fidget, so the inside spins. Oh, yeah, it's like a fidget ring, yeah. 
So you can spin it and everything around and nice. stuff like that. And there are, You should take these when you go to Mexico. Yeah, or anytime when I'm working because I don't want to mess yeah, it up. Yeah, so and you don't mess up your... I order a size 11, which is the exact size I wear, and they fit, they fit perfectly. Good. You know? Yeah, so, definitely. Start and wearing I don't those. like um, wearing those rubber rings. I just don't like the I know, silicone, that I guess it is. A lot of people thing, wear those, know? but yeah. I don't. But yeah, for $5 and if I mess them up... I'll do a so, close-up of them for yeah. you all so that you can see them up close. But yeah, that... That one, that's pretty cool. It's like yeah. black, gold, and silver, and it spins. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's cool. I like that yeah, one. Yeah, my phone's over here lighting up upside down, so I must be getting text messages or emails. So it is working like it's Oh awesome. my gosh, I can't wait. <laughs> I can't wait to watch the full video on that. All right, these are the two rings right here. This is the fidget one. This one is. So you see how the bands move when I move them? So that's pretty sweet. These are cool. Guess what I ordered? Did you say a bra? <laughs> yeah, that's what I ordered. <laughs> I paid three seventy seven for it. You might have to get a whole other drawer for your bra. No, I don't <laughs> because I just went through them all. Uh -oh. And I got rid of all my other bras except for all my Timu bras. That's about all I have left unless it's like uh, strapless. So that's like the only bras that I kept. This one is navy blue. So I bought the navy blue one. I already have it in like nude color and black in some other color. I don't remember what it is. To me that almost looks like slate. <laughs> it does kind of look like a, it looks like a gray blue yeah. kind of. But I love this bra. It's turning out to be my new favorite bra. Though I do still love my initial one. This one is just extremely soft and so comfortable. And if you don't believe me, read my comments because there are many people that's bought these bras already and they tell me how much they love them. So it's not just me. I order an extra large in case you don't know. And I normally would wear a 38 B or C and this fits and it does not get any larger than an extra large. So if you're larger than that, I would say no, but Love it. So, as everybody pretty much knows, I like to keep my stuff organized when I'm traveling or anytime. <laughs> so, I actually sure. bought this one here for um, so this little zipper case it actually has the inside pocket sleeve, which is the reason why I got this one is for my um, iPad mini. It'll fit perfectly inside. For it. sure will. And it's it's nice and padded. What's the little plug-in thing mean? It's um actually has all the accessory pockets pockets for everything that you can put in. All your little USBs and pop. <laughs> Look, I, this is, I'm thinking Apple Watch bands. Yeah. Because that's what mine looks like. Yeah, if you're traveling and everything, I mean, or yeah. going anywhere and stuff. I mean, it's got all the little accessory pockets. You even got the little pocket right here. It says for SD card, so photography, you know, or anything like that. That's pretty sweet. Um, like I said, I, for what I say it was, five thirty nine. That's a good price for that. Yeah, and the zippers. It's even got the little wrist. Um, Wristlet. So if you don't want to carry your bag with you, you just you know carry this with you everywhere you go. So that's nice. Yeah, I like that one. You no, know, and I'm always. Um, I might gotta get one. Gotta get one. <laughs> I'll send you the link. Oh, okay. Thanks. <laughs> send me the link. <laughs> okay, so you might know. Oh, these actually came with stickies. That's oh, a first. That is a first, yes. We order a lot of metal signs around here. I ordered this one for my mechanic. For So our car broke down and it was very bad. And it needed a lot. We were without it for like two months yes, or more, yeah. at least. Uh, but I'm telling you, since we got it back, that thing purrs like a kitten. Yep. It's so nice. He did an amazing job. And so I got him a sign for his shop. <laughs> Come and take it over there. It says, duct tape. It can't fix stupid, but it can muffle the sound. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a lot of signs in his shop, but he doesn't have this one. And I can tell you from, I paid $3.99 .99 for this. From the times that I was standing in the shop and the things that people came in there and said, this totally fits. I feel like he could just turn around and point. 
Just saying. And he's probably the type of person. And he is the type of person that would probably do that. He's he's a true southern guy. Yeah. <laughs> what is that? All right. So actually, this is something I just you know, being that we can do order off of ten dollars or more. Yeah. This was eleven dollars, and this was in and out of my cart so much that right as soon as it came back on, I didn't have nothing else in my cart. I just can't click. Okay. So technically, this is a um, a shower curtain. But yeah. I am going to. Oh, is this what you told me you were going to convert into? Uh, yeah. Yeah, for my curtain over top of my window in my in office. office. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. You know, it, just go a little bit higher than the window, of course, so that way it's not draining the ground. But it's definitely um, yeah, it'll go with my decor in my room and everything. It's Actually, cool. I think I have some um, I have some fabric glue. Mm -hmm. And so I can actually take that and spin it over and make a rod, make a center for a section yeah. for a rod. Okay. And then you can just do it like that. Yeah. And so, it'll just turn it into a curtain because it's just going to go back behind all your computer stuff. Right. And as you can feel, it's definitely a really good It's definitely material. thick, yeah. yeah. That's pretty sweet. So. That's a good idea. That'll keep, your, uh, keep the heat out of your yes. office for sure. Yeah. Okay, I lied when I said no more Halloween. I forgot I bought these. These are for, if, if you all saw that little black tree I bought, the one I thought I got two in the pack because it said two and I only got one. So I put in for a return because I wasn't going to pay that just for one. They told me to keep it. So I ordered decorations for it. <laughs> <laughs> I paid $1.58 for these. These are a little bit bigger than I thought they were going to be, but they're still pretty cute. So they're just pumpkin ornaments. That's all I really wanted to put on there. And so they gave me the twine. And a little needle. And a little needle, needle yeah, to poke super through. Super <laughs> But they're just little pumpkins that have different faces on them because the lights that are on the tree are orange. And then the tree's all wrapped in black. So I just thought these would be super cute on there. Pretty and cool. I think, I mean, they're a little bigger than I thought, but I mean, I still think they're going to dangle off the sides oh, yeah. and still be they pretty be cute. Yeah. You remember how it had mm -hmm. those little twig things on there? Yeah. So I may not even need this twine based upon the way that the tree is. We started decorating for Halloween, so... He that told. Video, he that told. Video will be coming soon. It'll be coming soon, but we are technically on vacation yeah. again. <laughs> I know it seems like we go on vacation a lot, but we really don't. Uh, everybody's in town right now, so we are on vacation this week, and then we're leaving Sunday, and we're going to be gone until Wednesday night for our little mini vacation together, and we're going to a concert. So we still have to do the tree, yes. but yeah. we have, I think. All the outside stuff done mm -hmm. if we add anything else of course you'll you'll get to see it all in one video but he he still has to bring the tree down and then we have all the decorations for it already so it will it'll only take me like a day to put it up but yeah, yeah. that's gonna be exciting mm -hmm. I can't wait to see how the tree turns out Are you done now with yours okay, nah. you one more I, I think I have one more little thing all right well, this is my last thing okay so I actually paid twelve twenty eight for this. Mm. It was actually going on my desk, but I thought, I've seen quite a few different ones. See my phone's lighting up over here. <laughs> this case is so cool. I know you guys have already seen it because I put a clip in the video, but I have not yet. <laughs> I might have to get me one of these though if I keep looking over there. So this is actually the classified oh. being a pen holder or a cell phone holder. Really? Yeah. You think it'll look like? And, um, yeah. But what it is, is this is actually a Roman soldier actually holding out. I'm going to put the sword across here. This is the oh, sword okay. it does before you have your pen and everything like that. Okay, so it's made out of resin. Yeah. Just so that you know. So, and as you can see, it will hold your phone. Oh, it sure does. Right there in the front. No, I don't know. So, I'm not sure. Just in case you couldn't see yeah. it on the table, but. Here it is right here. And I'll do, I'll insert a clip right. with a close up of him so that you, I'll show you all the way around him and stuff. That's really cool though. Yeah, I, you're I gonna like, like that yeah. on your uh, desk. Yeah, I thought so too. Goes along with that Joe was talking about the Roman Empire stuff did it. <laughs> okay, <laughs> ladies, if your men are watching with you or even if they're not, don't ask me why this is. I never think about this. My friend asked me the other day, apparently this is a thing. 
I had no idea. I'm not huge on like uh, social media trends, trendy stuff. I just put out whatever I want and that's it. So apparently men think about the Roman Empire a lot. I never do, like ever. Not one time has that popped into my head for any reason. So my friend asked me about it and I said, never. And she just laughed because we were out thrifting. She just laughed. And I said, what is that about? What's that about? She said, text him and ask him how often he thinks about it. What was your answer? Quite a bit. <laughs> Quite a bit. The phone is... It, I, that phone's yeah. cool. <laughs> Very distracting. Yes. Ladies, ask your men how often they think about the Roman Empire. It's crazy. If you don't look it up on these trends... Men in Roman Empire. I just can't believe how often men think about it. I never do. Like, ever. Her husband said, all the time. Like, she was crazy that she never thinks about it. <laughs> That's a whole nother video. <laughs> I just don't get it. Okay. Okay, I paid a dollar forty-eight for these. I got these um, for my son's girlfriend for Christmas. Oh, oh, there it is. I bought these for myself actually a few videos ago, but just in case you didn't see it, I'll show them again and I'll do a close-up of them. And they're they're so cute. They are football earrings, uh, but they're like little studs. <laughs> They're really cute, shape of football, and they have like brown and clear, uh, like little glittery studs all in them. So these are super cute for your football girls. This is a good little, cute little gift, nice little stocking stuffer. That's that's what I'm getting them for uh, Emma for. So I paid $1.48 for those, and then I got these for myself, and I paid a buck forty-eight for these, and it says that they're titanium. So they're just little, like clear stud earrings. That's all they are. And I, I did get them though because I like the backs of them. I think they're screw on backs if I remember right. Yeah, they are. And I'll, I'll show you in a, a closer video of them, but they screw on the back does. So I like that. And if I can get it back on there, hang on. Maybe I don't like that. Maybe it'll get on my nerves. Yeah, it'd be kind of hard to do when you're having to go behind your ear. Maybe. It really won't be. It's really not. It's just trying to be difficult now. But on the back, it has like a little clear stone on there as well. So this is the front. It's got the clear stone there. And then the clear stone on the back oh, too. Okay. Do you see it? Yeah. Yeah. So it's super cute. I like them. Like a two in one. Yeah. <laughs> and it says they're titanium. So, I mean, these are earrings that I would probably leave in like my second hole like all the time. guys that's it that's the end of our video that's everything that we have to show don't forget to give us your advice on these items that you've seen like my hooded sweatshirt that i have <laughs> no idea what to do with or if you have any ideas about what we can do i mean i know that's a uh, shower curtain but if you might have ideas that we could do we can yeah i know y'all are crafty yeah y'all y'all convert stuff into other things all the dang time so I don't have anything else. You don't have anything else. Just staring at my phone over here because it keeps uh, lighting up. Like, okay, I like I'm this. super jealous right now. <laughs> Hope you all have a great week coming up. And as always, we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.